What it do, what it is, what it do, what it is. It's your boy, Mr. Mind Gone, back at you one more time, one more again. You know, I've been away for a minute, um, in and I've been busy, just came back on vacation. Congratulations to my son, Frederick uh, Taylor, graduated Auburn University this past weekend, and I'm so blessed and I'm so proud of you. Thank you, son. Love you, always. Hey, day. Now it's time to turn another page to a chapter in your book of life. Okay, but uh, for my fam, Shoebox Squad, the Facebook and YouTube um, uh, followers, love y'all too. You know, thank y'all for supporting me. I want to get that off the top. You know, y'all don't know how much it means to me just for the few people who do follow me on Facebook and Instagram and uh, YouTube, all my subscribers, everything y'all do mean a lot to me. Don't forget about the giveaways coming up pretty soon. But uh, what I want to do today is just recap last week's drops. You know, uh, I didn't get a chance to make a video on them, but I did cop a couple of pairs. You know, still salty about losing them Travis Scott's uh, Friday, but... Uh, I mean, the work's trying to get them still and everything. Might have to pay retail, resale. Don't really care too much for that. And um, absolutely hate <coughs> to pay resale and everything. But I like the shoes, not because of Travis Scott's name. It's just because it's a dope silhouette to me. And it's a dope colorway and everything. And I love the shoe. You know, and I do have the OGs. Uh, or actually, right here. Yeah, I do have the OGs and everything. Uh, so... I'm trying to get them, but without further ado, because I don't want to keep y'all too long, um, I did pick up the University Blue Fours, um, end up double up on them, thank you to the uh, Flex Apps, shout out to you, and um, also off of Flex App, I was able to hit the Red Flint, uh, let's just get into it, okay, first off, we're going to go backwards, We gonna, the Red Flint came out. Um, Saturday, so we're going to go with them first. Everything. Oh, here's the box. Uh, typical Air Jordan 13 and 14 box. Size 10 and a half and everything. I was actually, um, this was a first call, first serve. I hit on the app, but I had a member of the, uh, the crew wanted the pair and everything, and they can't wear a 10 and a half. I'm a universal, I can wear a 10 and a half or 11. So I just gave them to them for retail, and uh, first come, first serve on the 10 and a half for my personal pair. Okay, box label reads, 10.5 size, Air Jordan 13 Retro, Jim Red, Black, Flint Gray, White, USD 190. Let me get into it. All uh, 14, I mean 13 box. Okay. You know this seat. Um, foot locker. Well, foot action, rather. But, um, this is what they're looking like. And these models are nice. First time this uh, colorway in this silhouette has dropped, you know. And so I had to grab it. I had to grab it. Got the OG Flint's. Still DS, ain't um, had a chance to wear them or had a opp uh, situation or opportunity that I felt was uh, needing to wear them. But uh, let's get into these. Okay, starting at the uh, bottom, you got typical uh, 13 bottom with the traction pads right here. The jump man uh, in the hologram with the red uh, background on it, red hints right here. And they was calling this. Uh, I think a, uh, a leopard uh, paw print or panther paw. That's what it is, panther paw and everything. But uh, yeah, it's an overall dope shoe. You got your uh, white paws right here on your gray midsole right there. And this suede, um, kind of new book, got that uh, back and forth action. I don't know if you can see. Yeah, you can see it. I can see it. Yeah. Okay, normally what a flint blue would be on the OGs, you got this red colorway, and uh, it's not a deep, deep red, 
At least the camera is not showing it as a deep, deep red. And it's also reflective. It's reflective. So when the light hit it, it uh, kind of uh, glows up. Uh, it's like 3M in the background, but it's nice. You got your hologram, which is uh, Jordan and Jumpman 23. Now they're kind of focused. I always leave that, um, that plastic on my holograms. It, for some reason, it makes me think that it uh, lasts longer. It doesn't cloud up like the holograms on 13s do after a while. Uh, you can see it is focused now. So you can see the Jumpman and the 23 in it. Okay. Rolling around back to the front of the shoe. I don't know, this lighting just, my lighting ain't been right since I re, uh, I, since I redone my sneaker room, my lighting, I guess I got it in a different op, uh, uh, place and it's just terrible sometimes. But you can see, I'm trying to focus on it, that uh, tumbled leather on this toe box. It's very nice quality. Quality wise, it's very nice uh, leather materials on this shoe. You got your uh, Jordan right there. And um, like the 13s, I always have the number 13 on the back side of that Jordan right there. You got your white rope laces. They didn't come with any other laces. But uh, white rope laces going all the way up, laced up, factory lace. Still got tumbled leather going up the tongue. All the way up to the Jumpman logo. On the front of the tongue, it's black jump man logo, and then you got uh, the interior is red, and they made it overlap over the tumbled leather, so you can actually see the red interior from the front of the shoe. You know, I think that was kind of dope too. You know, getting around here, your tongue tag, um, that's the jump man logo right there, and let me see. The manufacturer date for this shoe was 10, 14, 20, uh, through 1, 22, 21. So, like we always getting, uh, lately we've been getting a three month run on the production dates on this shoe. Oh. And you got your white insole with your red jump, man. Take the shoot you out. Oh, kind of hard for my. Okay, you got 10, 10 and a half, just like my 11s have 11, 11 and a half on the uh, shoe tree on the interior of the shoe. And uh, that's basically it, fam. You know, not a whole bunch to this shoe because it's, uh, it's just like uh, the flints, the original um, blue flints. But it's a dope colorway. Like I said, I had to have this the first time this shoe has released in this colorway. And I, I love it. So I'm said I had to have it. A lot of people uh, don't, didn't like it, but uh, if you like it, uh, I'm pretty sure they're going to do some restocks, which like all joints do, they sold a lot. But it's a very nice shoe. No. And the uh, uh, other shoe I won't uh, pull out because this is exactly the same shoe. I've already looked at them. You know, and they are, I know, like me, Y'all probably saw everybody else's video on it, but like I said, I had to put my video out. I had to put my little take on it. Put the back in the box. Okay, fam, sorry for the little interruption. Um, <clears throat> things been crazy for me and everything. I completely forgot that next pair of shoes that I had originally unboxed, I did a whole video on it. It was the University Force. So I decided to cut that part out um, after going back and looking and editing. I'm thinking, what the heck am I thinking about? But um, just for uh, that sake and everything, <clears throat> I'm going to go ahead and give you all a little footage of my weekend. Um, after, I mean, before I uh, went and copped the shoes. Uh, is This is my son's graduation. I had to walk, let him, see him walk across that stage and everything. And I got actual footage of it. So I appreciate y'all for viewing my videos. Please like, comment, subscribe. Don't forget about the giveaway. And uh, invite your friends, share this video, show it to anybody. You know, let's help build a community. All right, peace. Frederick Taylor. Freddy! Let's go! Let's go! Baby boy!
That's my son right there, y'all. Frederick Taylor. Love that boy. Love that boy! Love that boy! I was getting I was getting him walking down. I'm getting him walking down, then we finna walk down. Huh? Yeah, I can be down.